Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Fallout 4 Tips and Tricks. Today I'm going to be showing you where to find an unlimited source for steel, crystals, and fiber optics. This is not a cheat, but you might consider it an exploit. I personally think it's barely an exploit. You don't have to do a bunch of gymnastics to get it to work. It just does. But I'll let you decide if you think it's an exploit or not and whether or not you want to take advantage of it. Anyway, you're going to want to go to the town of Jamaica Plain. If you've never been there before, it's a bit southeast on the map, not too far southeast of Diamond City, just west of the Adam Cats garage. If you've discovered the Adam Cats, chances are you've discovered Jamaica Plain. You'll want to find the town hall in the center of town. Now, there are a lot of feral ghouls here. You'll likely be mobbed by close to 10 or 15 at once, so bring a lot of ammo. Molotovs are also a good idea. Once you've cleared the place, head upstairs and find a dead gunner named Sal. Sal has a missile launcher and missiles. Take those if you don't already have them because you'll need them later. Then head downstairs into the basement. Equip the missile launcher and aim down the hallway filled with laser tripwires. There are two turrets down there that you want to destroy, and this also disables the lasers. There is a deactivation code you can find somewhere in the town, but truthfully I can never remember where it is, and just blowing the place up is a lot easier and quicker, and way more fun! If you have a companion with you, make them stay on this side of the hall so they don't get in your way and ruin things as they are so apt to do. And then go to the far end of the hall and open the security door. Then close the door again and that will reactivate all the lasers. Now you can disarm each one which will give you one steel, one crystal, and one fiber optics per emitter. Once you're done, you should have 49 of each component. But wait, that's not unlimited, you might be saying. Well, if you feel like you absolutely need more, just go back and open and close that security door again. It will reset the lasers and you can harvest to your heart's content. Now I have twice as many components, and can even do it again and again and again. You could stand here all day if you wanted to and just walk away with thousands of steel crystals and fiber optics. 
but it really only took me 10 minutes to do this three times, and I can't imagine needing that many crystals, truth be told, but there you go. All right, everyone, that wraps up this video. Let me know in the comments if you think this is an exploit or a legitimate resource. I know some people don't like using exploits. I personally don't like using most of them, but I feel like this one wasn't as exploity as some of the other ones. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already for more tips and tricks videos like this one. Don't forget to like me on Facebook for the most up-to-date news on my channel and other game-related news and random stuff. Thank you for watching, everyone. I'll see you later.